Hey guys, Mike with m and Prospecting here. Um, as you just seen, my lovely wife is working on the floor. Look at her go. Go, Gadget, go. <laughs> Alright guys, today what we're doing is we are working on the inside a little bit. And, uh... It's a little rainy outside, so as you can see it's kind of a muddy, nasty day. So we have opted to work inside. Today, what we've done is we put that seam in, and we got that piece of trim I'm checking it out. We are getting ready to seam this carpet together, which is not really that hard to do. Let's see if I can get past my honey here and we seen this room got it all seen together and everything is ready to go I gotta put a screen in yet but that goes outside so this room is pretty well ready I gotta finish trim up there in this corners and over in this other corner and in order and put a doorknob on but I'll have to cut that out of there and then finish trimming that across and with that hole that's going to be a little bit of fun so I have to get me a little bit of mud to put up in there but then I'll get this room finished up Probably tomorrow, if it's going to be wet and nasty, uh, I'll finish doing the siding up next week after it dries out some, but putting trim pieces up on this, this is pretty easy, it's uh, nothing really hard to do, and then seaming this carpet is really not hard, you just got to have a good sharp blade and uh, a good straight edge to seam that. And I rented a kicker. Well, I bought a kicker. And in order to seam this carpet together, you got to use this fiber backed glass or uh, glue, glue edge. And what you're going to do is you're going to fold these over. So they lay flat. Hey, you missed a nail down here. Where? Right here. I just stepped on it. Oh yeah, I missed one down here too. Right here to front These of nails toe. are bull hockey. You don't have to fart in my face. I didn't do that. With my hip popping. God. But anyways, what you guys do is you uh, trim that corner out. To where it'll lay flat in there you got to kick it over a little bit because there is a tack strip right there and there's a tack strip over here right here so once you get that trimmed over ready you can kick that over but you got to have your padding laid down in there flush and i'm actually this has got in this oh, seam down here there is an insulation strip, but I'm probably going to take some of this carpet pad and put over there so there's a nice smooth transition across the floor. So I don't know if I'll show very much of it, but that is what we're doing, and I'll show you the end process after I'm done with it. This is what we're doing. Yeah. She's laying around just being lazy on me. Unnecessary nails out of <laughs> All right, guys, we'll be back in a little bit. All right, guys, we've got said living room cleaned out, cleaned up, and the seam is put in. Um, I'm gonna have to rent a stretcher to straighten that seam out just a little bit gonna have to come across to uh, this side of the room 
so that that seam will lay down nice the way it's supposed to but other than that what you have to do is you have to have an iron you gotta make sure that's cut straight which that is nice and straight it's just the way they had the carpet laid over uh, it stretched it out some so what's going to have to happen is I'm going to have to stretch everything back this way in order to make it work. But as you can see, everything is done except for stretching back that direction. So once that is done, then it's on trim work and that we'll be doing tomorrow after we finish the siding up on that end of the house so as you can see we're starting to move a few things in here and there there's our kitchen table laundry facilities done there that's better laundry facilities back door this is the kitchen beautiful kitchen into the living room Center Island floors, refrigerator, stove. Gonna look good after we get our stuff in here. And here is the master bedroom closet. the bathroom and the toilet is back around there and the sink there's one of the kids' rooms furnace the other bathroom. And the other bedroom. Still got to put that screen up. <laughs> so, for now guys, that's enough. We'll show you more as the progress goes along. So guys, quit dreaming. Get out there and live your dreams. Get you some.